Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 3, Episode 20, and today we're going to be talking about the new leaked videos and new leaked photos from the set. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any Supergirl videos later this year. So recently there were some 1L photos that were released online, and they got everyone super hyped because we got a first fully motion look at 1L in his actual new red suit from the comic books with his blue and red color scheme and it's really awesome so we should expect that suit to come around about episode 15 or so and the episode that they were shooting currently at the point of last week when they were actually shooting this scene with mon was actually episode 20 so expect this scene to be in that episode and so they did a few takes of it and some people were recorded it on the set so all rights go to those people that recorded the videos i will leave them linked in the description below they were leaked via twitter as you can see we get to see mon in his new red suit that was awesome he's wearing the suit he's holding some sort of gown and it's some sort of ceremony of sorts you would have to assume at first but I actually have some details that have been released via Twitter and so Kara and mon in this episode actually travel to Argo City and yes I know you guys might be thinking what but Krypton exploded and Argo City is a city on Krypton but no so Argo City it turns out has actually survived and this is confirmed information and Allura Zorel Kara's mum actually survived the explosion so at the same time as shooting this scene with Melissa Benoist and Chris Wood, the actress who plays Allura, the recasted actress, Erica Durant, was actually seen on set, and it turns out that Kara and mon in episode 20 will travel to Argo City, wherever it is in the universe right now, because we don't know where it is, to get guidance from Allura, most likely in stopping the world killers. So this is massive news, Allura is alive, she survived Krypton's explosion, as Argo City was saved. So in the comics, Argo City actually survived Krypton as well as it was flung out of Krypton and it floated in space for a number of years, with it actually not circling around any sun, so it was released from Rao and didn't orbit that, so it was just in space, but it had its own gravity, it maintained that, so that's why the people could survive, and Kara's mum and dad actually survived that, but in this version, it seems like only Kara's mum actually survived, as she was in Argo City at the time of the explosion, and potentially her dad could have survived, but he's less important in the big scheme of things on the TV show, so Argo City could be in the survival zone, which is similar to the Phantom Zone and that is where Argo City actually ended up in at the end in the comics and that's how Argo City actually survived after the aftermath of Krypton's explosion so potentially they could adapt that comic book storyline into the TV show and so it's similar to the Phantom Zone I don't think they will be able to age and that's why Kara's mum will look the same and so that is the information on that part of it but Kara, mon and Allura during that scene where mon is actually walking up in a Kryptonian esque place he's actually walking in Argo City and he's walking up to meet Allura and they're going to chat about what's happening on Earth and mainly to do with the world killers and how to stop them because obviously Allura has the information that Krypton had and you would have to presume she's going to actually stay there afterwards and rule there because you know there needs to be someone in charge and I'm guessing she's in charge in Argo City wherever it is in the universe. So when mon actually was walking past it had a lot of fields around it and it's actually roughly the same place where they shot in that episode one scene and so it's not in that dream scene but it's the same place so it seems like the place where Argo City is actually situated is that place where we saw in Kara's dream back in episode one in the field so it seems like it is near a ringed planet so that was foreshadowed early on so I'm really excited to be going to Argo City so it's a part of Krypton so you will see Kryptonian elements there because you know it's a Kryptonian society and so wherever it is we're going to be visiting it in episode 20 and it's going to be an awesome segment of the episode and mon is actually going to be meeting Allura for the first time not in hologram but in real life and Kara is going to find out that her mum is actually alive so big things happening so anyway guys thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later goodbye